Does your PC sound like this? Yeah, no thanks. Let's get you quietly to All Systems Go. This is DIY in 5. Hey everyone, I'm Trisha Hirschberger and you are watching DIY in 5. Today we'll be discussing how you can easily DIY your way to a quieter PC or laptop. Whether you live stream, create content, work in a busy office, or just want some peace and quiet while gaming, this video will help you diagnose and treat a cacophonous PC or laptop. As always, if you find the tips in this video useful, please feel free to like this video, subscribe to this channel, and ding that bell so that you don't miss out on any future tech tips. Generally, when a PC or a laptop is making a ton of noise, it's thanks to the fans spinning so fast they sound like they're trying to power your PC for takeoff. If your fans having the party of the century is your issue, let's first check to see what software is running. If the PC is relatively idle and you open the Task Manager, that CPU usage should sit right about 20% or less. If it's more than that, check to see if there's a certain program eating up all your usage. This could be a background program you forgot about, or perhaps malware is eating away at your system resources and needs to be expelled into the ether. Now, if your fans are spinning super fast when you're playing an intense game or using any other intensive program, that's your computer working as it should. Heat is the enemy of performance. And when your computer works harder to give you a great PC experience, your fans work harder to keep it cool. But this does not mean you are forever stuck with loud fans. Whether you are on a PC or laptop, you might be able to control your fans' behavior via your BIOS settings. Every BIOS is different, but you might be able to just choose a basic high or low setting, or even fine tune the fan speeds on a curve based on CPU temp. Check your motherboard manual for information on how to enter and adjust settings in BIOS. If you don't want to mess with BIOS, there are other third-party software solutions like MSI Afterburner for GPU fans, SpeedFan, etc. If your PC fans cannot be controlled by software, let's say it's a DIY build and the fans plug directly into the PSU, not the motherboard, you can look into third-party accessories like adapters and control knobs to manually adjust fan speeds. Another potential cause of a noisy PC could be overheating due to lack of airflow. Perhaps a trick as simple as adding feet to the bottom of your PC tower so some air can get underneath, or adding a laptop cooling pad or lap desk to your laptop setup rather than setting it on a pillow or other plush surface could do the trick. Less simple but equally effective, if you have a closed PC tower, you might think about upgrading to a case that better optimizes airflow. In that same line of thinking, sometimes rearranging the fans you already have to a new airflow pattern can work wonders too. Honestly, sometimes all you need is a good old fashioned cleaning. Perhaps your fans are working overtime because there's dust and other buildup restricting airflow and creating more heat than needed. If you'd like to see an in-depth video on PC cleaning, feel free to check out the video linked in the description. Now, if your fans are clean but still making a ton of noise, you may wish to replace your fans. If you are not only hearing fast spinning, but also a clicking, buzzing, or grinding, your fan might be on its way anyway. When you are buying a new fan, remember that larger fans tend to be more quiet than smaller fans, and pay attention to CFM, or airflow, as well as the DBA, or noise level, specs when shopping. We've been talking a lot about overheating and fans, but you may be hearing a buzzing or clicking that has nothing to do with fans at all. If that's the case, it's time to open the PC or laptop and dig a bit deeper. Check screws and gaskets to make sure nothing is loose. A deteriorating hard drive could also be the culprit behind your noisy PC woes. If your hard drive is making anything more than an occasional click, it may be on its way out. In that case, back it up so you don't lose your data and consider replacing it ASAP. If it's a traditional hard drive, an SSD upgrade will be the quietest option. And since SSDs use circuits to store data and have no moving parts or spinning disks, they are generally much quieter than their HDD counterparts. Kingston has lots of SSDs in varying capacities with various uses in mind for you to choose if you are in need of a replacement or considering an upgrade. Like the Kingston Fury Renegade PCIe 4.0 NVMe SSD, perfect for gaming enthusiasts who want their PC to run fast but quiet. Whether it's overheating, software, or hardware that's making your PC or laptop sound like it's ready for space travel, hopefully there's a solution in this video that 
got things to stay a bit more grounded. Take care, everyone, and I'll see you next time with more DIY in 5. Oh,